Arterial blood gas measurements of oxygenation saturation, or SAO2, are the gold standard for assessing for hypoxemia in patients. Continuous pulse oximetry measurement of peripheral oxygen saturation, or SpO2, is commonly used to make minute-to-minute -minute decisions in the ICU. Some studies suggest there may be racial disparities in the accuracy of pulse oximetry. Valbuena and colleagues performed a retrospective analysis of the Extracorporeal Life Support Organization Registry to assess for racial differences between SAO2 and SpO2. Patients were within six hours of the initiation of ECMO and SAO2 and SpO2 measurements were near simultaneous. Occult hypoxemia was defined as SAO2 less than or equal to 88% on ABG despite an SpO2 reading of 92 to 96%. 372 patients with SpO2 92 to 96% were assessed. 186 white patients, 51 black patients, 70 Hispanic patients, and 65 Asian patients were analyzed. The root mean square error was higher than the FDA required less than or equal to 2 to 3% for pulse oximetry devices for all racial groups, 7.5% overall. For white patients, measurement bias was 0.3% and root mean square error was 7.3%. For black patients, measurement bias was 1.7% and root mean square error was 10.4%. Occult hypoxemia was detected more frequently in black patients compared to white patients. Logistic regression demonstrated that black patients had a higher risk of pre-ECMO occult hypoxemia than white patients. Logistic regression demonstrated that black patients with SpO2 greater than 96% also had a higher risk of occult hypoxemia compared to white patients. The risk of occult hypoxemia for Hispanic and Asian patients was equivalent to that of white patients. The authors conclude that pulse oximetry has limited and racially differential usefulness for the assessment of hypoxemia in acutely ill patients.